morning, Carrie. Good morning. Um, Vic, I think Warren slept in his office last night. I slept in a goat's mask at a witch's house last night. What's your point? A witch's house? Yeah, my friend Cassandra. She's a practicing witch. Oh, well, uh, well, was she a good witch or a bad witch? She was an excellent witch. Oh, Carrie, Warren had me... Good morning, sunshine. Hey! The last time, Morley, I make the coffee around here. What was that all about? Well, uh, this uh, Java wuss seems to think the decaf is coffee. Oh, as opposed to that rocket juice you like to, to hep yourself all up with? Hep? <laughs> hep myself up with? <laughs> Listen, Dick, if I... I, I, I I'll do the pants myself, Todd. <laughs> You know, I may not know bits from bites, but I know that we do have the technology to have two coffee pots. Excuse me, but, uh, could you tell... Oh, now, now, son, I understand you're blind. <laughs> but that's no excuse to run around here unshaven. I know you're a moron, but that's no excuse to go around in that hat. Excuse me. <laughs> Sir. Uh, may I help you? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Morley? What is that stench? French vanilla mint decaf. It's one of the international blends. Vic, remember, we have two coffee pots now. Carl, I made you your usual tea. Uh, I... <laughs> yeah, a little herb tea for the rocket man. Uh, Vic, here's your regular coffee, nice and hot. Thank you very much, Morley. I, I added a little essence of macadamia. <laughs> ah, chamomile, nice. Uh, Carrie? Yes. <laughs> so, Warren's got an online girlfriend, huh? You know? Of course. You guys and your high tech tricks. <laughs> I'm supposed to go downstairs and get her. You mean she's downstairs right now? This I gotta see. Guys, wait. This is a delicate situation, which requires some sensitivity, after all. So, although I do appreciate your concern, I really think it would be best if I handled this. Like a clot? Yes. Boy, those endorphins are just firing. Feels so good, I don't want to stop. <laughs> Maybe I should do some quick squat thrusts? <clears throat> Carl, I think I speak for the entire office when I say no one really needs to see you squatting or thrusting. I just don't understand, uh, you know, wasting uh, precious office time on, uh, y you know. Some companies have actual exercise programs. It's stimulating leads to better morale. Healthy employees work longer or more productive. Oh, God! Are you okay? Uh. <laughs> One of you healthy, productive employees come over here and put a bullet in my head. <laughs> so, how are you feeling? No! Uh, Carrie, it's the guys. We were just calling to see if you need anything. I need you to stop calling me. We were just, uh, uh, you know. No, Warren, I don't know. Tell me. What? 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 I'm sorry. Right now, patience is not one of my virtues. I have a sprained lumbar disc. The doctor says it's pretty common and... and do these stretches where I have to put my legs over my head. <clears throat> I'll be right over. <laughs> but you're gonna be okay, right? 
because I just get so worried when someone your age gets hurt. <laughs> Look at us. She is gone for five minutes, and already it's like Lord of the Flies in here. Well, who's going to manage the office while she's gone? Well, I guess, uh, Todd. You mean it? Oh, man. I, I won't let you down. This is so cool. I got to call my mom. <laughs> what time is it in Helsinki? She's a roadie for Bjork. <laughs> It's not going to be the same here without Carrie. Yeah. It does seem kind of empty without her at this desk. Without her sitting here and ordering things? Gosh. You know, if you sit right here, you could still smell her perfume. <laughs> What are you doing here? Oh, I don't know, beating you to it. <laughs> Where's Carrie? Oh, well, she was right here on the... <laughs> I had a little spasm on the way back from the bathroom. Oh. <laughs> Carl? Unless we're auditioning for Flower Drum Song, I think we can move a little faster. Vic, that part of my body isn't numb. Sorry. Well, that settles it. I'm not leaving you alone today. Don't be silly. I'm fine. Besides, you guys need to get back to work. Well, you know, I could set up right here and telecommute. Tell what? Work out of your house by being electronically linked to the computers at the office. That's what we should do. We? We? I, I don't remember Carrie inviting you. Actually, I didn't. I... If you're staying, I'm staying, pal. Well, I didn't... Look, I, I was here that... first. I have dibs on her phone line and her modem. What are you going to use? Well, I have my laptop in the car. I can just get an ISDN connection running and then Wait, I can... wait, wait. Better. We run a T1 line... And splice the wire for optimum <laughs> bandwidth. Oh, now we're in business. Yeah. You guys sure you want to go to all that trouble? No, you shouldn't be alone. And, and I, I don't, don't trust, trust you with him. him. <laughs> oh, my God, you are doing this! Telecommuting. <laughs> yeah, sure. I put in a full day at the office, and you guys are having an orgy. No, no, no. The guys have been working very diligently. We were just taking a little fun break. In fact, if we were at the office, uh, we'd be going home about now. Hint, hint. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is I'm sort of tired, and I kind of need you guys to leave. I just got here! <laughs> you know, I am feeling a lot better. I mean, I'm able to get around, do for myself. I really want to thank you guys for keeping me company and helping me out. I couldn't have done this without you. So I'm going to take one more day just to be safe, and I'll see you in the office day after tomorrow. Yeah. You're sure you're okay? Yeah, but I do need to lie down. Good night, Carrie. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night, Carrie. Good night. Fun without you at the office. Well, I'll be back tomorrow. And Carl? Yes. My key? Oh, uh, well, I was thinking that maybe... Carl? Okay. <laughs> and Vic? Yes. The copy you made? Oh. <laughs> I was this close. <laughs> and really, guys, Thanks again. <laughs>